After a couple of hours drive from Syracuse, we just arrived here in the beautiful town of Ragusa. We have this breathtaking view from our hotel and with the tower of one of the most beautiful churches right here, right in front of our balcony, right on the side of our balcony. We are now very excited to explore the town, so come with us. So relaxing. Yeah. And look, first time we see a cloud since we arrived in Sicily. It's still 31 degrees. It's super hot. So we are gonna escape a little bit and go to the main garden, the Giardino Iblo. Wow, this Giardino is so beautiful and it's so pleasant to be here, guys. Uh, this actually reminds me a little bit of a garden that they have in Capri. I don't remember exactly the name of the garden, but it's kind of like in a more or less similar vibe. This city of Ragusa is located by the mountains in the south of Sicily. It's one of the Baroque towns of Sicily, has 68,000 inhabitants and it's also a UNESCO World Heritage Site. The entire city is a UNESCO World Heritage Site, how cool is that? The atmosphere here in the park is perfect to escape the heat, but now that the heat is already gone, I think we are ready to explore a little bit more of the town. Okay, the heat was actually intense. So we decided to freshen up a little bit and we came here to a gelateria. It was really funny because when Tim was trying to order, he ordered like the pistachio no. flavor. Lemon and ricotta. Lemon and ricotta, yeah. And the guy was like, no, 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 you don't mix this too. So yeah, we had to change our flavors, but this is actually what I like about Italy is that if the flavors don't go together, they will let you know. So you can have the best experience. Mm. Can I try this? You have to try this as well. Yeah. Mmm. Mm. What is this? Tiramisu. So what did you get? So this is pistachio and this is lemon. So it's not ricotta? Not ricotta, no. Wait, so what did you want to mix? Lemon and ricotta. I wanted to mix lemon and ricotta and said yeah, it was not a good idea, so now it's lemon and pistachio, okay? And you can tell the ingredients are very high quality. Mm. Delicious.
The receptionist at our hotel recommended us this place called Al Gradino 248. We just ordered here some white wine of the region for the aperitivo and look at what they brought to us. Look at how amazing this aperitivo is. We have a little bit of everything here and everything looks delicious. This place is some sort of aperitivo bar located in the stairs and look at the view that we have from here.